I just, it's really important. Um, like, I really like, would like it back. Tonight, a happy ending for one man in Bowling Green who had his bike stolen earlier this week. It wasn't just any bike. It was a nearly $3,000 hand crank adaptive bike. Amy Steigerwald takes us along for the ride. Eric Ryan has never let Spina Bifida get in his way. In fact, here's him back in 2016 competing at the state track meet. He typically uses his adaptive bike to get around Bowling Green. I've had this bike forever and like it's been uh, my lifeline. But on Tuesday night, his hand crank bike was stolen right out of his parents' wheelchair accessible van. We keep the bike in his van so it's easily accessible. Um, and yesterday morning we realized that our vehicles had all been gone through. The Bowling Green Police Department put out a call asking the community to keep an eye out. Social media users quickly spread the word. Meantime, security footage captured people using the bike not long after it was stolen. A simple post yesterday morning has just blown up into about 500 shares and um, the police department has been working hard. And that hard work paid off. Eric's bike was found and delivered right back to him by BGPD detectives. <laughs> now, obviously, when anything gets stolen, the Bowling Green Police Department is going to work to try and get it back. But this item in particular was extra important for them to try and find as soon as possible. When somebody steals something like this from somebody that obviously needs this, it's a special thing that was made for them, uh, we do take it kind of personal. Police charged 23-year-old Cameron Fox with stealing Eric's bike and say this arrest also led to other discoveries. But for them, the important thing is that Eric's bike is not damaged and rightfully returned to him. How's it feel? Great. Happy to have it back? Yes. In Bowling Green, Amy Stuggerwald, WTOL 11.